Hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to workers and resources in the um, Soviet Republic. Yeah, that's where it is, the Soviet Republic. Right, so in our ongoing Western Republic series here, we have got uh, bauxite export going. And I had commented that maybe I would uh, go ahead and uh, start doing things like a construction industry this time around. But I want to check something first. Now, uh, if, we, uh, if we look at our prices, we need chemicals to uh, produce actual uh, uh, aluminum, aluminium. Um, right, so uh, we can sell aluminium oxide for 931. Um, uh, chemicals, however, are ridiculously expensive. Okay. Well, uh, I think we probably won't uh, go into that, uh, but we might want to look at making a chemicals industry. You know, that might be interesting. Um, how are we doing here? We have we have lots of um, yeah, we're not maxing out bitumen, but we definitely have lots of fuel. Right, okay. Um, now, a chemicals industry. I think we have enough people over here we could do chemicals. Yeah. Let's just take a look here at what's involved in doing that. Uh, that would be under various industry. No, that would be under here. Chemical plant, yes. Um, oh, we need oil, wood, crops, gravel. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Right. Well, I think we won't do that at this point. Um, we had a fire that got extinguished. Yeah. Uh, extinguishing fires does seem to be the thing to do. Right. Okay. So if we look in here, our... Uh, bauxite storage is full. So we can actually go ahead and uh, run more uh, bauxite export trains. Yeah. So what we've got here is a single uh, bauxite export train, right? Um, which uh, each uh, train load is, uh, you know, 40... Or 34k, right? So if we go and find our train depot, which is over here, uh, we can go in here. Now, what did we? We have a PW201E. Okay, we're gonna buy with rubles. Um, we'll buy one of these, and we will. Uh, Go into a cargo wagon. Um, we need... Is it a hopper? Yeah, it's a hopper. Yeah, okay. So, one, two, three, four... That is uh, yeah, that's the uh, the size we want. We don't have a duplicate, do we? No, okay, so we'll go back in here and I'm gonna put 
Uh, okay. I'm going to make... Oh, come on. Uh, two trains here that I'm going to put on the... Um, Uh, here and here, right? Um, oh, wait, no. Um, no. Close that. Uh, go in the lines. Yeah, that's what we want. Uh, we want rail lines, bauxite export. We will assign that here, and we will assign that here. Yes, okay. And then we can start these trains. No free rail track. Huh, okay. Okay, I think I get it. Or do I get it? I don't know if I get it. Oh, what? Huh? Well, I can't get from the middle over the... Ah. Let's uh, see if we can fix that. Can we do this? Yeah, we can. Okay, we'll build that. Okay, that should make it a little bit less um, bad. Okay, that's probably what happened. Okay, right. So we're going to go... Uh, where is our... Our bauxite trains are headed... Uh, up here. Okay, yeah. So, we have a train leaving. Okay. Now, we were filling this completely with quite some time. So, uh, okay, there's our second train that we just launched. Okay. So that took a quarter of it out, right? Now, it'll just keep uh, filling up. Now, how's our uh, our bauxite uh, plant is running at pretty good capacity. Okay. And our mine is running at pretty good capacity as well. Right? We could possibly put a second mine in there, but this is, that's a processing plant. But this, oh, that's not, that's not keeping up. Okay, yeah, so maybe we can put a second bauxite mine. Yeah, let's, uh, let's see if we can possibly do that. Uh, uh, okay, bauxite mine. Hmm. We'd have to put it over here. Um, we could. Um, yeah, we could. Let's do that. What? No. Yeah, demolish that building. Um, okay, so let's, uh, Let's just build this, right? And we will uh, buy a new mechanism, speed 33, okay. Okay. We're going to do that. Now, we're going to need a 
fancy um, right we're gonna need a fancy conveyor operation conveyor engine okay right okay so it needs to um okay how are we going to do that Um, yeah, that's going to be a bit of a challenge. Right. Well, what we need to do is uh, demolish that. Oh, we got to sell the mechanisms first. I put it in the wrong angle, right? So we can't get it into the thing. Hmm. Yeah, wait a minute. Okay, so we got an output here. Um, so, okay, well, let's see if we can, well, we'll start out with one of these, okay, now, can this get through to there, no, um, okay, what we're going to do, pause it, yeah. We're going to take the power line out, right, and we're going to take the uh, road out. Okay, now, um, now we will see if we can get a conveyor engine to uh, connect. Uh, we can, okay. Uh, well, let's um, let's queue this stuff up to build. Right. Close that. Uh, build that okay now we need to get power to come through there right um, okay we'll build that right now we'll come in here and why can't we get a road through there? Uh, well, we'll cancel that piece, right? Yeah, we can get that through there and that like that. Okay. Do that. Okay, now we will uh, get everything ticking along. Okay, so now we've got a... Oh, we probably want to try and uh, get some sort of a road affair off of here. We won't be able to. Can we? No. If we do this, can we get a road to sneak through there? No. No, we can't. Okay. Well, we're going to have to take the risk that that ends up on fire. Okay. Right. <clears throat> now, this is filling up. Good. Now, how's this doing? We don't have any people but it's operating we have people and it's operating so 55 50 okay yeah so we're doing better on the box site 
Now, how's this doing? We are keeping up on our exports, so that's good. Let's uh, go look in here. Get rid of that. Uh, okay, so we're exporting more. We've spent a bunch of cash, and yeah, we're exporting more uh, bauxite, so that's all good. Um, right. So let's uh, check in down here. Uh, over here. Right. So over here, we have lots of uh, crops and storage. And we have... We are not... Uh, we are keeping up on the export. We're exporting the uh, alcohol as uh, fast as we are able to uh, produce it. Right? So... So that gives us a uh, pretty decent uh, uh, process thing going on here. We have uh, we have lots of people down here. So right, okay, everything's good here. Uh, we are just finishing up harvest. Are we? Yeah, we're just finishing up harvest and uh, collecting the crops from the fields. Okay. So this, this operation down here uh, does seem to be functional. That's good. Uh, right. Good. Uh, so that's operational. Uh, at some point, I think I want to build a road or something that connects um, this area with the rest of the um, Republic. And I think um, I can go straight up. I'm going to have to build a bridge to do it. But I can go across from here. Okay. So the first thing I'm going to do, this is just to uh, 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 connect up the, uh, the, whole, uh, the whole area, right? Uh, and I'm going to do this with a gravel road, uh, which is going to come this way and this way. Um, then we come across like this. Uh, and then we can come in here. Okay, so that, uh, that will connect that. So we can definitely connect that up. Uh, we're definitely going to need a bridge across this water here. So uh, what's our arch bridge? Uh, prefab bridge. Concrete bridge. Let's build a bridge. Yeah. Okay, that's going to cost a fair penny to build, but we need a bridge and uh, we'll build it. And then we're going to connect a road to either side of it. Right. And then we're just going to run a road down the side of the... Uh, you know what? Let's make it a dirt track from there. Yeah. Because a dirt track is cheap. Yeah, uh, right.
So this will give us a uh, connection, at least, between the two um, town sites, right? Which is the goal here. Right. Oh. Um. Okay. Okay. We'll get things uh, flattened out enough that we can build the uh, dirt track all the way down. We'll be able to uh, obviously expand this stuff at, whoops, uh, a building is on fire. Pump jack. Huh. The fire was extinguished. Now we need to come through. Um, yeah, we'll come through this way. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Okay. And then, okay, so that's in theory a uh, road connection all the way up there. That's a long road connection. Okay, and we need to go up here and. The road has been built. Okay. Uh, you know what? Since this is right beside the town on this side, I'm going to do that. Yeah. Okay. Now. Okay, that definitely gets that. Uh, the fire was extinguished, so that's good. Right. Now, uh, is there anything else we need to do? Well, I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. Not there. Okay. So we spend a fair bit, and we're all almost closing in on a million uh, rubles again. So uh, we've definitely got a profitable republic going on here. And this is definitely keeping up. We could probably get away with one more export train for uh, bauxite. I'm going to try that. So we're going to buy a uh, electric with one of these and... Uh, Cargo wagons, one, two, three, four. And we're going to go in here, in here. Bauxite export. And we're going to do this. And then we're going to launch the train. Okay. So we'll get uh, one more bauxite uh, export uh, train running. Uh, and we're starting to get some real train traffic going on here. Uh, some potential uh, traffic jams and queuing and everything. Now let's uh, just check in here. How's our aggregate doing here? Well, we're... Uh, we're definitely uh, filling up the aggregate pretty quickly, so... 
Uh, and that's with uh, coal trains arriving quite frequently. So eight ninety nine, 99, 100% just as a train pulls in. Okay, so we're still doing okay there. Let's take a look here. We have lots of uh, workers here. This aggregate is pinned. Um, these guys are busy. Uh, yep. And so is this guy. Busy-ish. Okay. So things are uh, ticking along there. That's good. Um, yeah. Okay, that's fine. And we established that our fuel production was doing fine. Yep, we have established that. Our uh, Yeah, so I think probably somewhere around here is where we would set up a chemicals industry, but uh, that's going to be more complicated than, uh, than it looked. Yeah, well, uh, let's just uh, check in on the uh, economy stuff uh, and just see where things are. So we spent a bunch. Uh, so, um, yeah, so we spent a bunch, so that's why our uh, total down, down here is negative. Uh, we're a third of the way through the month and we're, we're down 140 K. So, uh, you know, we're, we're not so, so bad off there. What we might want to do uh, at uh, you know somewhere down the line is maybe try some tourism. Yeah, we could try some tourism. Hmm. Yeah, we could. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, that's a, a new thing in a recent update, the tourists. So uh, I might leave that alone for a bit. But as you can see, our uh, deficit is uh, down to uh, just over 84K at the moment. So uh, we're, we're definitely doing uh, a great deal of exporting. So our exports are at 300, like 400K already. And our imports are at like 110 k right? So, um, so if we look here, we're importing power, and that's what we're selling to the uh, the uh, NATO people, and we're importing we're importing some coal. All right, yeah, that's down at the uh, bottom there. Um, yeah. Okay, and we're importing stuff that we're selling in uh, in shops. So, you know, we have that. So if we go back here, yeah, so we're up to 500K here, and we're, we're positive down here, and we're not even two-thirds of the way through the month. So uh, we've definitely uh, ramped up our uh, exporting game quite a bit here. And that's kind of the goal. Uh, we wanted the, uh, the Republic to be basically... Um, solvent right uh, and solvent is what we uh, we have managed to achieve here now let's look at our exports no that's a western uh, soviet block exports so we've exported a boatload of bauxite we're exporting a boatload of steel we're exporting bitumen for decent cash uh, we're exporting fuel for decent cash and alcohol's adding up to a decent amount. So, yeah, we're uh, we're not doing too terribly there. Okay, and we're almost up to 100k here. So now let's check in on the loans thing. We need 200k, a little over 200k each each month to uh, to pay uh, the uh, debt service here. And if we go back over here, uh, you can see 
that our surplus from uh, exports is well more than double that. So uh, we're we're definitely in a situation where we're not uh, we're not going to run out of cash again. I don't think uh, you know as things run, if we do things at a measured pace, it shouldn't be too big of a deal. Right uh, now. Uh, future plans. Yes, that's going to be an important uh, thing to uh, to comment on here. Uh, I'm going to give uh, the Soviet Republic a bit of a break. So we'll call this, uh, you know, ending the season. Uh, and we'll ha I'll, I'll be back in a while with more, you know, another season, so to speak. But it will take, uh, you know, I'm taking a bit of a break. And I'm going to uh, take the time to cover uh, Voxel Tycoon again. So Voxel Tycoon will be appearing in this time slot next week. I'm switching back to Voxel Tycoon at this point because the Soviet Republic is getting a little bit, you know, boring-ish at the moment. Um, and I want a break from it. I mean, I've been doing it for three quarters of a year or something like that, right? And uh, I'm going to uh, do, do a little bit with Voxel Tycoon uh, since it's just had a it's just had its early access release on Steam yesterday as of when this video comes out. So next week I'll have an episode of Voxel Tycoon and that uh, that will uh, that will switch things up a little bit. It's sort of relevant, so I'm going to start a series there, and we'll see where it goes. Anyway, uh, that's uh, basically where I'm going to leave it uh, at this point. We've done a little bit of uh, tinkering on our uh, uh, Boxite setup. And uh, we've got... Uh, we basically got a like we got a 260k surplus after we spent 340k. So uh, on uh, vehicles and uh, a whole load of that. So uh, yeah. So this is uh, definitely uh, going to um, going to be uh, uh, you know we basically got everything straightened out so that the finances will sort themselves out uh, uh, this will take uh, 1614 days and everything will be paid off if we don't pay anything early so uh, 1614 days is uh, uh, under five years so yeah it's uh, it's going to It'd take a while, but uh, we're up over a million rubles again, uh, as you can see. So uh, if we go back over here, yeah, we're up 300k here. Uh, so we're, we're basically up 650k on the year operationally. Um, so that main, means we're up 400k so far, or, or in the month rather. It means we're, That means we're up 400k with... Uh, you know, net gain on the rubles, right? Uh, so yeah, we're uh, and we've ticked over into October, and uh, we've got uh, uh, you know you, we we don't have the extra expenses now, and uh, so last month we had a three hundred twenty one k profit. It was actually six hundred and sixty k less the 210 for debt service so 450k so we're almost half a million rubles up monthly now so yeah i think that we pretty much got the game won from the perspective of not going broke there's a lot more we can do though and that's what we'll be looking at when i come back for like a season two and we'll continue with this same republic as long as that's possible because starting from scratch Unless I was going to try something like Cosmonaut mode, yeah, probably not going to be terribly exciting. We've seen it all, after all. Okay, 
So I'm going to uh, call that the end of the uh, episode and the end of the first season of Soviet Republic because it will be back. That much I know for sure. I don't know exactly when. Uh, when I have a hole in the time slots, I'll probably bring it back then. Anyway, that's, uh, that's going to be all for, for this episode. So, you know, stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. I mean, maybe there's some sort of a light at the end of something resembling a tunnel. Uh, I'm starting to be skeptical of that. But anyway, uh, you know, things are what they are. Uh, but still, don't let it get you down too much. There's no percentage in that. Anyway, yeah. So uh, also, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, whatever. Apparently, it does something. It may even be useful. Yeah, your mileage may vary. It's up to you. doesn't make much difference to me one way or the other. And, of course, see you back next time for, in this case, Voxel Tycoon.